hey hello guys this is samir so today we are going to see how to install and configure apache kafka multi node cluster into uh, centos 7 so you can configure in uh, on prem or uh, other cloud so in this tutorial i am using uh, google cloud platform uh, so i have spun up uh, three uh, three node uh, CentOS machine, CentOS 7 machines. So, okay, and I have SSH, all three machines. So, uh, in uh, this tutorial, will split split uh, into two two part parts. Uh, in this part, we'll see how to do a prerequisite in new machine. And then later on, we'll see how to configure a uh, multi node Apache cluster. And we'll, uh, we'll do some, uh, we can say, practical things. Uh, we can say consumer producer, tropic creation, retention policy, and all things. Okay, so this is three machines. These are, sorry, these are three machines. So, first, we have to, these are all new machines. So, we'll, we'll, we'll do this thing into all machine so first we have to be root user uh, 2 and 3 sudo hyphen i sudo hyphen i and you can use su hyphen root so up to you <coughs> yum update hyphen y because it's new machine, so I have to be. Uh, I have, I want to make it up to date. Yum update. Heaven why? Yum update. Heaven why? So it's updating all uh, rep uh, dependencies and repos, everything, uh, packages, everything. Of center is seven. So once done, uh, we'll do etc host configuration. So we'll, we'll, we'll let let them up, upgrade. Okay. So just copy this twenty nine thirty thirty one. This is a Kafka one two one. Two and three. This is th twenty nine, thirty one, thirty two. Twenty nine, thirty, thirty one. Okay, sorry. Thirty and thirty one. Okay. So after this, let it update. Okay. Now the next thing is we have to install wgate or using curl you can uh, for download. Uh, this is for download. We need say dependencies are, is most uh, like this Kafka will work on uh, JVM. So we need. Uh, open JDK or Oracle JDK. So I am going to install Oracle JDK. Okay. So okay. Let it update. Okay, it's updated. This one is updated, and this one is also. So we are good with a part to install it to install it to install it here so you can use same package right no need to install everywhere just you can install into one machine you can scp so i am installing to all machines it's up to you right so let me let me close it okay 
okay uh, now uh, you have to go to oracle side and you have to install uh, download this package this one this package 3131 so you have to click download this is my way to install cancel copy link install it this one I will install same thing same thing let it in download this is done now we'll install it using rpm hyphen IVH IVH and RPM whatever RPM we have so let is let it download it's downloaded you see so just move it to JDK eight RPM. Now just install it. RPM have an IVH. an RV edge and add edge installed Java version sorry my bad install okay install into all machines right now we are done with this step now we have to configure this into all machines so we i we i etc host and just delete this entry and then put this entry one two three these are three things so this host name we have to put into one machine two machine three machine As in this is fresh server so
we'll see okay okay Okay, this is done. This done. So we have to stop uh, firewall D. If you want firewall D in your project, <coughs> so you can keep it. Otherwise, you can stop it. Like you have to add uh, our ports, open port. You have to close port. Like everything you have to do. I don't want to spend time much in this. So I will simply stop it and okay, okay. status and stop. Disable the showing status is running, should not show if you're running. It should disable stop, it should stop and disable. Now stop. Second thing. Third. If you just status, it will be inactive. So this is done. So this thing we already did, right? Downloaded and installed it. So here I did SCP, so no need to do it. It's, it depends like download it and see to all uh, Kafka thing Kafka it's, this is installed now it's time to download uh, zookeeper okay so we are going to uh, do three zookeeper uh, we are going to keep three zookeeper and three brokers okay so we'll download it into all server so here we can in root I will download it's downloading one so no need to download the internet like if you download into one and you can say CV so it's up to you so I'm downloading so it because it will save our time because Google Cloud and it's pretty fast okay this is done you have to untar it uh, into all downloaded machines no worry this script I'll put into my website formwellday.com it's done uh, then we have to create Apache Kafka directory into all OPT folder created this one is also created and last one yes created so three we have created and then we have to move it move extracted zookeeper directory into Apache Kafka one two and three so uh, now we are good if you do ls hyphen ltr to this particular directory you will get zookeeper and two so we'll change it as well we'll make it root root uh, I think here I did it but I don't think so okay one more step will do C H O hyphen R 
root root okay so it will change ownership so i think we have to do here okay so uh, now zookeeper we have installed zookeeper now it's time to download kafka this is the website so you if now it is 2.3 but i did uh, i i did it uh, i am using 2.2 so it uh, it's up to you which version you want to configure the steps are same so download Kafka so I'm downloading Kafka so you can do if you have 10 server so no need to download into 10 server just download into one and do SCP into all server actually I did SCP so use SCP download into one and SCP to all server so it where it will save your internet if your speed is not good so you can do this now uh, next thing you have to same thing you have to enter it first second and third done now you have to move it to same uh, opt apache kafka directory which we created at the time of uh, zookeeper right then move it second same thing move it and third also move it okay now we have downloaded and now we'll change now we'll change it again to as a root the owner is root now because now i am using root so i am using root owner so it depends like which user you have as per your user you can change your ownership okay it's not a bit hard so this is the thing we are done with uh, our <coughs> basic setting hope you enjoyed this uh, video this is the first part like up to download now in second video we'll do configuration and we'll start um, zookeeper kafka and uh, we'll do some bit testing okay so i think we are good thanks for watching this video please comment uh, subscribe like whatever you want and if you have any uh, suggestion please let me know thank you thank you very much